Hello there guys, how are we all doing today? I hope you're having a marvelous time. Guys, as you can tell, today I got my Western Hog Nose. I am amazed by him, he's absolutely adorable. Bit nippy, and also he musked me on the way, you know, to... <laughs> after I got him out, but he's absolutely adorable. Honestly, love him. Yeah guys, uh, we'll get straight into the video, but yeah. Thank you again for watching this so far. And thank you again for watching all my videos so far. Guys, yeah. God, I'm really bad at intros. Anyway, like, subscribe, and let's get on with the video. Alright yeah. then, guys, get into this video. As you can tell by the title, my snake finally arrived. Oh my god, I'm so happy. Oh, I'm so happy. He is absolutely adorable. But yeah, a couple things happened. One, he tried to musk me. There's a bugger. Tried to give me a little nip. It failed. But yeah. <laughs> we'll go through that in this video, really. But for now, we'll just need to focus on mainly getting next to us. Hopefully, anyway. I mean, I don't want to get rushed by red, you know what I mean? See ya! <laughs> what the hell, man? <laughs> that was a strange. Extremely strange. Uh, <laughs> um. <laughs> anyway. Yeah, they arrived, no complications, no nothing, it was, oh, it was a feisty little bugger, of course, he was very scared, but yeah, it was a feisty little bugger, it was a bit scared, of course, but it's to be expected, he's travelled halfway across the UK to get to me, so, bless. There goes that one, I guess. Up. No, no, no! Oh, damn it. I'm so bad. Green team's been eliminated, but uh, it's perfectly fine. But yeah, it's, it's a way I'm perfectly fine. I put him in the quarantine. Oh my god! Like I said, I've put him in a quarantine setup, so it's not his actual setup that he's going to have, but you know, it'll do for now, because, uh, yeah, I always put all my animals through three months worth of quarantine, especially when I get them from somewhere either I'm not too sure about, just in case. It's basically just to make sure they've got no health problems or nothing, and I can keep track of the stool. Yeah, I know it sounds wrong, but, you know, you need to keep track of stuff like that, especially when you've got a snake you don't have a, you know, clue what could happen to. <laughs> Damn. Yep, cheers. There we go. See ya. Bye bye. <laughs> but yeah, I, I'm, I'm going to do it out of precaution, really, guys, because. Yeah, I just don't want anything bad to happen to it. This way I can keep track on every little thing it's doing without no complications. So yeah. I'll show you all the clips I've got from me opening the, the guy up and everything. Hello. You just seem to be doing the uh, staying at your base challenge. Right then guys, as you can see here, this is actually going to be the temporary setup for the hog nose. It's not a proper setup, but sorry, it's technically a temporary one like I keep saying. Right? Pretty much this is what I'm going to use for quarantine. Because I've got so many pet snakes, it's really not healthy, just in case the snake that I'm just getting now has something wrong with it. So, it's going to go in here for now. It does have a proper setup, but for now, this is what it's going in. Just for a quarantine period. And the quarantine period I put most of my animals in is three months. So, yeah, it is still going to have all the proper equipment, like the heat mat, the start, everything. But for now, it's just got to go in here. This way, with these paper towels, I can keep track of uh, its stool everything so if i see any blood in it i know there is something wrong and to get him straight to a vet it's pretty much the best option i've got because you know i don't i don't know the buyer that i'm getting the snake from i just know it's halfway across the uk so i've had to go with this but yeah guys i thought i'd show you the little setup i've got for the quarantine period and yeah let's go with it shall we? <laughs> right 
This fella's... I don't know if I can get him in there properly. This fella's already must me, so he's a bit scared. Bless him. And this Chad biting me. Oh, God, that scared me. Oh, God bless him. Look at this. How cute are you? Oh, I'm so happy we got him. 150 quid well spent. Ooh, don't fall straight at me, you dirty bugger. You've already mussed me, you've tried nipping into me, that failed. Don't be false striking at me. You've got attitude, don't you? Bless you. Oh no, not again! It's Grey, Grey might be coming towards me now actually, so that's actually a good thing. Oh no, he's not. Oh my god, what's Grey doing? I'll go for Aqua later because honestly, this seems to be staying at his base. Grey seems to be on the attack, so that's where I've got to be careful. Got a cat bridge today. I haven't been over here for a while, so hopefully, yes, a whole lot of goodies. Right. Let's see if we can get over there as fast as possible because I don't want to have Grey coming back on me or even trying to get me while I'm trying to get his bed because that's just awkward. Too late! <laughs> Do you honestly think I don't see him? Is he right in the head? I don't think he is. Okay, uh, dude, are you okay? Are you okay in the head? I'm just making sure. Yeah? We're good? You all good, fella? Yeah? I'm just, I want to make sure before I do anything that you're okay down there. No, he got me! Damn, he just got me! Ooh, so close. <laughs> but yeah, guys, uh, all the stuff that you've seen, like, uh, like I've specified, the quarantine is technically also for my animal safety as well as the rest of the animal safety because, well, I've had a case in before where we got mites. I don't know if you know what they are, but reptile mites are like fleas, I guess you could say, for reptiles, snakes, all that. Invis, son of a... Because I don't see it. Is he right? I probably should have put my gold mat away, but I uh, rookie mistake by me. Uh, where could he be? He's here. Hello, sir. Dude, what are you doing? What are you doing? Come on. Dude, don't run. Thank you. That's so hard. <laughs> yeah. Pretty much in the past, I've had a case of mites with my animals, and oh my god, Zara will also tell you it is a big, big pain. Like, we had it for, to deal with for like ages. We finally got rid of them, thank god, but you know, it was still a pain in the butt until then. I just threw my pail. Oh my god! <laughs> I am truly a donut. Oh my god, Aqua, what is your bed defense, man? Aqua, what are you playing at, sir? What are you playing at? Looks like White was off after you anyway, so. Wow, what are you doing, sir? Guess he's just gonna let me do it. No, I just killed myself. <laughs> Has Aqua come off his uh, high horse yet and left his island? He hasn't. What the? Do you still think I'm there? I think he does. Oh my god, this guy's a donut. 
He thinks I'm still up there. Oh my word, you've just noticed me. Will this still work? <laughs> I prefer having a fight instead of just, you know, winning like that for the final. Where is he? Oh! I know what he's done, he's caught onto the water! <laughs> Let's watch him die! <laughs> oh no! Should we see if this does anything? Oh god. Okay, okay, this is actually funny. This is funny. He wants to live. Should I let him live? No, I didn't think so. <laughs> oh my god, that's hilarious. <laughs> I'm dying! I'm dying! Oh god! Oh my word, that was amazing! <laughs> Guys, thank you again for watching this video. Sorry it was short, it's just a tiny update. And also to show off the new snake, of course, like I did say, we have got a Mr. Male Albino Hognose. Amazing animal. A bit scared at the minute, but after a couple more weeks I will do an update on him, as well as his handling progression, which should be better by then. But yeah guys, without any further ado, I shall see you in the next video. Don't forget, like, subscribe, and peace! Oh, <laughs>